Hello, today we are going to talk about the proper configuration you have to choose inside of X-Plane to fly this plane correctly. Hello and welcome back to next tip of the CIA Marketing, developed by uh, J. Rollon, J. Rollon, Rollon. Uh, planes and uh, sync colors. We are here with one of the libraries I just did. It was very easy one to make because uh, when I was making the texture of uh, all the plane I just put this library behind uh, because in Substance Painter when you paint you have to you can put uh, layers as well as in Photoshop but I wanted to create some kind of uh, Metallic one, uh, like the, the the frame of the of the of the plane. So yeah. you can see this is a aluminium one, uh, not so reflective as uh, as uh, for example uh, some chromatic, uh, as you can see for example in, in the front of the here in the front of the of the propeller, the cone of the one is more reflective. Okay. But uh, today we are going to talk about uh, how you can configure the plane to fly properly because usually in X-Plane, when you enter X-Plane, uh, a lot of people don't know that there is an, op an option uh, to make flight correctly because usually when you fly your planes you are having a lot of help from X-Plane to fly. So uh, the plane has a lot of stability that is fake stability that control this is explained to you for you to fly better and that is a shame because the flight dynamics of this offers explain are also awesome and I think you you would need to to fly correctly the plane how it should be so especially in er helicopters in helicopter this is uh, tremendously uh, uh, a break uh, experience so by default usually this care this come uh, at the middle these these parameters and this is found in the manual usually in the manual it's everything about this this plane but the people usually don't read manuals okay so here we have the recommendations how to uh, change the uh, the parameters you have to to do to put in your in your simulator so to find this one you find it uh, usually here the joystick and here choosing one of them it doesn't matter it don't have to be the joystick or whatever uh, control sensitivity sensitivity and you will find it by default like this you are having uh, the experience the 50 percent of the experience you will have with any airplane this is not for just the uh, same market of course each spender will uh, or party city party will tell you about which is the best for this but for uh, explain Sia uh, Marchetti to 60D, uh, we recommend you to put this all down. So the plane is going to be more nervous and the way it should. So you are going to be able to make better uh, uh, aerobatics or it's going to affect tremendously to the, to the flight dynamics. Of the plane, and then you have to put this the pitch to 75, the roll to 50, leave it in 50, and the jaw in 90. Of course, these uh, are more or less at the real one. Then you have to calibrate your your joystick because it's too, too nervous and or it has to too much uh, noise. Then you have to reconfigure it uh, for the way to for better for you uh, but I would recommend this this these values okay uh, especially these ones to have a better experience and more nausea no no <laughs> it's joking when there is rough air uh, you will notice another recommendation that uh, it's not in the manual but it's a recommendation that it's not mine, it was given by my friend uh, Jose Luis Castillo uh, but it's true, it's, it's, I already knew about that one but in the past was performance, produced performance issues because uh, we had less FPS but it seems now in explaining 
11 that is fixed and it's less eaten eat performance so you have even you don't notice it is this one uh, you have to go here to the options and in general you have the flying model the flying model uh, flight model per frame you may need to run the flight model more times per frame if your frame rate is very low or you are flying extremely, extremely small fast or light aircraft in this case this plane is small this plane is fast and it's light so my recommendation for you for this plane is to put it here because in, at low per frame when you are landing you are having lower per uh, frame rate because you are maybe landing on a uh, on a city or whatever uh, near a city then you are going to have more solutions per frame to have in the flight dynamics so it's going to be have more as the real one this is the amount of air it passes through all the surfaces that are be be below the below the, 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 the visual model okay hope you like it uh, please subscribe uh, press like and see you next one see you ciao ciao thank you good flights